Hey, what's up, guys? Um, I'm just uh, recording uh, my a little commentary, kind of, um, over this gameplay of this Kronos Arachne game I got the other day. Um, and I'm kind of just trying out um, doing a commentary over a game as opposed to just um, what I usually upload, which is just like my live commentary kind of thing on that I usually stream. Um, so yeah, I'm just learning um, how to edit, basically. I don't really, I haven't really edited anything ever before. So I'm kind of having a first crack at it here um, with really basic stuff, like uh, just putting my audio over video and I cut out a couple like recalls just to try like uh, kind of transitions. Um, but for the most part, the editing is at a minimum. Basically, um, I'm just literally just using some software, putting some sound over video. So, um, yeah, you know, this Arachne kind of hoodwinked me early game. Uh, she like put loads of webs at blue and then. Um, pulled red so i was like distracted and then uh her webs did blue buff for her uh while i was distracted so she kind of um owned me <laughs> in that respect uh so i'm kind of just running out of mana slowly here even though i've got better clear than her because she doesn't have uh golden blade because golden blade's not in the game anymore they changed it into equinox um Unfortunately, I'm kind of just getting webbed on super hard. I'm trying to use my mana quartile um, pretty well. Boom, look at that transition, nice. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, I kind of just uh, have to back eventually and I think she gets the red, I'm not sure. Um, but I'm focusing the rock here because I know uh, any character that uses pets like Arachne and Bastet, you really want to focus getting the Meteor. Um, because that's it's going to help you deal with the pets um, very much so. But yeah, she does get the red. I don't know really what I'm doing here. Not getting the blue buff a little bit earlier. But hindsight's twenty twenty, you know. Um, so yeah, I mean, I didn't want to talk about too much. I'll do... I'm, I am kind of just doing a little commentary. But that's not really the primary thing. It's just to... I'm kind of just learning how to edit. And I figured I'd um, talk about whatever. Um, Nice beads by the Arachne. You don't always have to beads and get the kill. She just kind of got a lot of pressure and poked me out a little bit. Um, I'd have liked to see her go for the blue buff after that. Um, since I thought the beads was good, to be honest. Um, she could have used that poke advantage to go get my blue, I think. But I'm not sure. Um, yeah, so... Um, I mean, I'm not really... I'm not trying to go... Um, full youtuber um exactly i don't really know where it's going um but i'm planning on just uploading every day i feel like that's like a short-term goal because it's fun i don't it's really not a lot of work um so i mean don't expect that to end i guess um yeah just getting webbed on every wave you know you love to see that um but I don't know. The game plan kind of for this game is uh, to scale, which, you know, that's kind of like a copium thing to say, but you're always trying to scale with Kronos. He gets a lot of passive uh, power every, I think it's three minutes, um, but I could be wrong on that. Um, but he gets a lot of passive. He basically gets more and more um, power over time. So kind of longer games do work out in Kronos's favor. The only thing I'd say is that you, you could argue that I should be punishing the Arachne a little bit more, um, given that she can't she can't go Golden Blade. Um, oh, I don't know what just happened with the video, but here we are. Um, so, yeah, uh, she can't really clear waves, but she, I don't know, she has a lot of damage. She's gone like uh, Equinox into Jotun, so she does have a lot of damage, but yeah, she can't really clear waves. Uh, and yeah, there's an argument to say I should be doing more than what I did, but when she hoodwinked me at the start and took the blue, 
Um, it kind of gave her a really good start. I don't know. She's. I don't know if she's like backbaiting, trolling. I don't know what's going on. But here we are. I mean, I'm not going to... I don't like get egoed and then change how I play. You know what I mean? I'm just going to keep being annoying, back backstopping and stuff. Um, and obviously, I think it's like super meta to be going double lifesteal. You want to be going double lifesteal or... I mean, Bancroft's into Typhons later on, um, pretty much at any game. And uh, obviously, Breastplate has been a mage go-to second item for, I don't know, how many years, how many seasons it's been. But um, the only, I guess, difference to other seasons maybe would be like Wing Shard um, that Kronos uses really well, and it's really strong right now. Um, and Sprint, just because the Arachne... She can force my ult, and if she forces my ult, and I don't, and I get slowed, um, and I like either miss my three, or she beads it, or ults it, then uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna probably thank myself for having sprint. Um, and I think sprint's a little better than beads, um, but it only just maybe because it gives attack speed, you know. Um, so yeah, um, focusing every scepter. Um, basically what I've done for the last couple of minutes and uh, scaling up not um, the Arachne is not making enough, many mistakes really so you know it, 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 kills aren't really going to happen if um, I'm just Kronos scaling up um, so yeah this, this video it's kind of just like a scam video well not a scam video but it's a I'm just trying to figure out how to um, use to edit anything. So I appreciate this being the kind of guinea pig, as it were. Um, oh, nice steal. Bam. Steal on the little XP camp. She gets both. She gets both chesters here, which is, you know, soul crushing. But um, that's how it goes. Um, but yeah, I, I'll, I, I'm, I think I'm... I'm not exactly fully transitioning from Twitch to YouTube, um, and I, I'll probably stream on Twitch here on out, but um, uh, it is a lot easier to make uh, YouTube content than Twitch content, if that makes sense, um, and I can like record a video in much less time than I can stream um, like for three hours, So, and it's also kind of fun to just learn um, different like YouTube stuff ways to hack YouTube, like in terms of like title, algorithm, um, thumbnails, but also just like getting into the kind of nitty gritty of like editing and figuring out what to do. Like a couple times in this vid, I already like edited backs. So they were cleaner and like I cut them out basically because no, no one needs to see you back and run back to the map. Uh, no one really needs to see that, but I didn't do it for all of them because it is, you know, I'm not, I'm just trying out transitions and stuff like that. So it's like, there's a lot of uh, weird stuff that n I would never know, you know, um, but I guess so it goes. Her getting absolutely webbed on, by the way, she's just got Jotuns and she is like running it down. But I think she kind of lost, she also ra uh, slammed a red pot this as soon as she could. Um, which is, I don't know if I'd call it meta, but I've seen it more and more lately. Um, and I feel like it would work against less uh, prepared players a lot more of the time. So I'm not going to blame it or like hate on it. But I feel like it, it can't be completely correct to do every game. Especially if the counter of it is me just not dying to it building items and then she's 500 gold down you know either the pot's going to expire or we're going to have a one for one or whatever as long as i don't die for free it's it can't it can't be efficient to just slam a 500 pot well maybe i'm wrong um so here i i'm like trying to fight to the death i miss my three uh which i think the most it would have done is probably get her beads or ult but if she altered i would have got the scepter so um, you know, you have to respect the fight to the death for the scepter. Um, it's kind of, <laughs> it's kind of the favorite thing to do. Um, 
But yeah, Pestilence, basically the most efficient magic pro item you can get. If you don't need mana, um, you know, which Shogun's and Genji's gives, um, then... I mean, she kind of does need mana, to be honest, but uh, Pestilence is just such a beating, especially against the double lifesteal build that mages go uh, right now. But I'm still trying to use my clear advantage. She literally can't kill creeps. It's like sad, kind of, but... Um, it's all gravy if I'm missing, you know, all my skills, my three and my one, you know. She ults me here, which uh, was actually a pretty good ult, considering my three was down and my ult was down. So there wasn't, that was a really good window for her to go on me. And also she's just, as I said, she's still got that red pot ticking, so she wants to use it. Um, but, you know, I've got a ton of sustain with double life steal, so I'm not kind of going anywhere either. A lot of running at me and then running away and then running at me and running away again so it is what it is but yeah anyway i'm i've basically done what i wanted to do which is uh talk a little bit um and i just want to say uh thanks for watching everyone thanks for all the love on youtube and i'm gonna let you guys watch the rest of the gameplay uh i guess i think i can turn the sound back on so um enjoy guys bye bye draw Okay, uh, Rod plus... Looks like it well, is gonna have to be a short stream, guys. Got some attack speed now. Fuck, I keep doing the wrong quartile. Get this red, and we're gonna backdoor even if he kills the minions. Looks like. Yeah, and I get more, more stacks if uh, this is probably down. He's been pretty good about doing this XP camp. As I get more power from Bancroft, I get more strength. Hey, Missy. <sighs> She's a lost cause, man, I'm telling you. It sucks that I lost that. Doom Orb would be okay, actually. Oh, no, I'll go, I'll go Toxic Blade. Hey, Charlie. This is terrible, man. Baby is just losing the plot. Spiders are good body blockers. Not the best, but felt like she couldn't really kill me even if I missed a couple of those. I think this will be down. Can I actually do this? I don't think so. kind of weird too. Because I might lose red now because of my like random push. Spiderlings did a fuck ton I think.
Nice. I have conditioned him to respect my uh, my threes. Time to move. It's okay. Stone Tower Perfect. only lasts a few hundred years anyway. These are probably sick for the spiders, honestly. I saw his pestilence uh, meter, so I am a bit... Faster than him. It doesn't matter, I guess. He's got Arandite, okay. It's a respectable strategy. NT. <coughs> Yeah, I thought that was fine. Okay, my 